Hello everyone, in this video we are going to discuss about xerostromia which is also known as dry mouth. So let's get started. What is xerostromia? It is the dryness of mouth which is a clinical manifestation of salivary gland dysfunction. It is the subjective clinical condition of less than normal amount of saliva. What are the causes of xerostomia? There are several causes like radiation therapy, local factors such as smoking, mouth breathing, systemic alteration like pernicious anemia, iron deficiency anemia, diabetes, HIV, surgeon syndrome. Developmental factors like abnormalities of salivary glands such as salivary gland, aplasia, several drug therapy also leads to xerostomia such as anti convulsant drug, anti emetics antihistamines, antispasmodic. What are the clinical features of xerostomia? Xerostomia effect on oral function like it increases thrust, increases uptake of fluid while eating, difficulty in swallowing, burning and tingling sensation, abnormal taste sensation in mouth. Xerostomia also leads to salivary gland enlargement. There are various effects of xerostomia on normal function like hypofunction of other secretory gland, blurred vision, ocular dryness, itching. Xerostomia also lead to canidiasis. What are the clinical signs of xerostomia? Oral mucosa appear thin, pale and dry. Atrophy of papilla, inflammation, cracking fissured tongue. What are the management of xerostomia? We can manage xerostomia by stimulation of salivary production, symptomatic treatment, dietary management. Stimulation of salivary production can be done by local stimulation and systemic stimulation. In local stimulation, chewing gums, mints, paraffin use. In systemic, bromhexine, mucolytic mucokinetic agent can be used. Antholithion, A and T T dose, one to tab, one to two tablet thrice a day. Pilocarpine, five mg thrice a day. Symptomatic treatment by salivary substitute contain carboxymethyl cellulose or hydroxyethyl cellulose, fluoride salts. We can also use artificial saliva. What is the composition of artificial saliva? This is important. Artificial saliva contain carboxymethyl cellulose 10 gram per liter, sorbitol 30 gram per liter, potassium chloride 1.2 gram per liter, sodium chloride 0.843 gram per liter, magnesium chloride 0.146 gram per liter, dipotassium hydrogen phosphate 0.342 gram per liter. Oral hygiene product such as patients should use lactoperoxidase lysozyme lactoferrin what are the dietary management for xerostomia sucking ice cube sugar free candies use soft and liquid diet avoid salty food consumption of sweet foods drink frequently thank you for watching